Greetings, my name is Gilbert Hangel from Vienna and I will now present our ongoing research about the integration of 7 Tesla MRSI with neural navigation and intraoperative MRI. We recently introduced high resolution 3D MRSI of gliomas at 7 Tesla as presented by my colleague Sukrut earlier today. We also received an intraoperative 3 Tesla MRI at the Department of Neurosurgery. We now propose to combine these in order to introduce 7 Tesla metabolic maps into neural navigation to co register them with pre and intraoperative MRI and to obtain samples with a high precision from the tumors in order to allow a comparison to the histopathological gold standard. To this end, we will acquire high resolution 7 Tesla MRSI together with morphological imaging. After LC model quantification, the resulting metabolite and metabolic ratio maps will be converted back from MINK and NIFTY to DICOM uh, standard using the freely available software tool Caravun that I highly recommend for this purpose. The resulting DICOMs will be imported to the brain lab neural navigation and co-registered with pre and interoperative MRI. The tissue samples will be acquired based on MRSI hotspots on this co registered data and will serve as a gold standard for a histology MRSI comparison directly in these hotspots. Our MRSI sequence is based on a concentric circle readout in case space. For a closer look, I recommend looking into my colleague Lukas Hinger's publication from last year. We already have a prototype workflow going which is a bit work intensive and still requires the use of USB sticks to transfer data, but works well as you can see in this example where 7 Tesla uh, morphological T1 imaging is co-registered to 3 Tesla data. Currently we have achieved the transfer of MRSI data into neural navigation. As you can see in this example, a colon to NAA hotspot aligns very well to morphological abnormalities in this tumor and even to fMRI. While we have not reached our final goal yet, we made a lot of progress over the last year, thanks to the close cooperation of neurosurgery and neuroradiology. I want to highlight the importance of interdepartmental cooperation, which in my eyes is the key to success and also includes more departments like neuropathology. But you especially need to seduce your neurosurgeons into cooperation because these are the people that use the neural navigation and resect the tissue samples you want. We hope to reach this next necessary step very soon. So please stay tuned for our further results. I'm at the end. Thank you for your attention.